What's up guys, welcome to Supercars of London and a very early Saturday morning, but I do not care at all because today is the follow-up episode to my Idiots Go Lamborghini shopping that happened a couple of months ago where myself, TGE, Sam and Rue all drove down to Lamborghini Pangborn. Today's slightly different because there is no convoy, which sadly is a bit of a bummer, but it doesn't matter because all of the fun is happening at Lamborghini Pangborn. I'm gonna be meeting up with them. I'm gonna be documenting the entire process of Tom picking up his brand new Lamborghini. I am so happy for him, but at the same time so jealous because he is a man after my own heart and I can't wait to see what his car looks like in the flesh, in that showroom, sitting ready for collection. Since the last video, this is the first time that I've touched upon this subject, and it was my fastest growing video to a million views. So I'd like to thank all of you guys for commenting, watching, sharing and supporting the Idiots Go Car Shopping series. But as it crept up the million views, there was a lot of comments that of people that probably hadn't seen another Supercars of London video and didn't understand the Idiots Go Car Shopping concept. So if this video does what the last video did, let me quickly explain. The Idiots Go Car Shopping series is a lot of fun it's just a group of friends that have a passion for cars and we go around to car showrooms and just have some fun and show off what is on display at that car showroom. However, the last one was pretty special because Tom has been working his absolute socks off for the last 10 years or so and really wants to treat himself and I'll explain how much... What? And I will explain just how hard he has worked. For the last 10 years, he has been working his way up in the city, working for some pretty high profile banks, and is holding down a full-time job from around 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. in the city, whilst he runs a quarter of the London Muscle Online Fitness Company, which has recently just launched supplements, a mobile app, and of course they've got their cutting guides, bulking guides, and all of their food recipes to make sure that you eat healthily, that you train well, and it's all about balancing your fitness and your health around working a full-time job, which is why Tom is a perfect example for that. So for the last 10 years, he's not only set up a massive, massive UK and global company, but he has worked a full-time job in the city, which is totally incredible, actually. It is a fair play to Tom. He has worked so hard for this day, and he just keeps messaging me, telling me how excited he is. So I'm excited for him. So let's get a move on in the nuke and head to Lamborghini Pangborn. As I pull off the M4, I've just seen a Lamborghini in my rearview mirror. Woohoo! Getting ourselves warmed up for the morning. That was pretty epic. Very nice spec. Black silver wheels, red calipers. Yum. There he is. <laughs> so I have parked the nuke a little bit out of the way, which I'm sure I'm going to have to move, but I didn't want to spoil. Uh, the chaos that is unfolding at Lamborghini Pangborn at the moment. There is a hurricane spider and a hurricane rear wheel drive out the front, both in black. So actually my Audi probably would fit in. But there it is. Let's go and say hello to Tom and uh, see how excited he is. Oh, people are revving already. Immediately filming. Good morning, sir. Good morning, how are you doing? Yeah, all good. Excited? Yeah, it's a good day, sun's <laughs> out. And, uh... <laughs> Something else is going on as well? Yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> it's a big day. Very big exciting. Day. Yeah, Were you I mean, filming as well? I was, yeah, really, really badly though. So, uh, yeah, I filmed you as soon as you came in. <laughs> okay, so I've dragged Tom over. And so today is what, what day? You're picking up a Lamborghini. New car day. New car day. Yeah. Um, should we go and find it? Is it one out the back? No, it's that, it's that one. It's this one? <laughs> yeah. yeah. So wait. The first time we did an Idiots Go Car Shopping episode, you had a BMW M3. Correct. What happened as we left the car dealership? Didn't you slide accidentally onto the other side of the road? Accidentally, deliberately, out of control, maybe in control. 
definitely by accident. And now you've bought rear-wheel drive Hurricane. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I, I learned from that experience and now I'm an expert. Okay, so. uh, all right, okay. But you're excited? Thanks. Yeah, I don't look in, I don't sound it, but I am. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited for you because... <laughs> no, I'm, I'm buzzing, yeah. absolutely buzzing. This is country. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, uh, I think yeah. once you've done all of the signing, all of the paperwork and stuff, then... I've done the admin. Done it? Yeah, admin complete. I've, missed, you got here. I've missed the boring bit. I know, I know. So now I can just jump in a passenger seat. Yeah, you get all the good bits now. You don't have to sit around for it. We can go and do some admin if you want. I'm sure I can find some. Nah, I'm all right. To write down. I'm, I might have a look in the car. I got a, a spare orange pouch, a tracker pouch. Look at that. Oh my god. What a day this has been. Doesn't, but your calipers are yellow. Yeah, he's run out of the yellow ones. <laughs> I'm happy with that, alright? Happy. <laughs> we have snuck into the workshop because Tom is showing me this. <laughs> An LM002 Lamborghini. This is probably the first one I have ever seen. Same. I don't think I've ever seen one. It's got like pretty much exactly the same interior as a Diablo. Obviously with back seats. It actually looks nothing like a Diablo. Can't even see it. Great camouflage, can't even see it. Can you see it, Tom? No, see what? Bentley? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that what you're talking about, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice. Lovely W12. That's all I know. Is it a W12? I don't know. V8 something. Bentley. Thanks. <laughs> Look at that. They look so good. This is Craig, by the way, sales oh, manager. No, no. <laughs> I can't go on film. <laughs> Why not? Because I don't come out on film. Right. <laughs> this is the demonstrator Lamborghini yeah, Pangborn. Yeah, it's a new 610 Spider in Oops. a Rancho Borrelius. It's a pretty car. Very, very pretty. Show me your car. Have you got the key? Uh, yes. Let me see. Yes, I do. It's definitely not an Audi key because it says Lamborghini on the back. Uh, yeah, right? it's got a Lamborghini badge. And there's an yeah, orange yeah. thing there with the track. Oh, Where are you going? What are you doing? Right, let's let's jump in. Yeah. Glass engine cover. That's definitely an option. Correct. Uh, the wheels are an option. Twenties, not nineteens, are standard. I mean, I've been learning these things. Black exhaust pipes. Correct. And uh, the wheel finish is a slate grey as well. So. This is not the TGE that I know. No, I've been doing some homework, mate. Come on. This is the admin that you've been doing this morning. Oh yes, I've had a busy week. Stepping inside TGE's new Lamborghini Hurricane. How, generally, how does it make you feel sitting in this car knowing that it's yours? Terrified for the general public. <laughs> um, other than that, yeah, no, I'm very excited, obviously. It's a dream come true. I can't actually believe it. It doesn't feel real. It is. So nice. Hurricane seat mats. Apparently they're an extra. Move my uh, yeah, that, yeah. There. That looks like an extra. Double stitch, so that's very important. I was told they were double stitched or some something like that. Yeah. So yeah, you must. Lovely yellow stitching to match the brake calipers. Alcantara inserts. Yeah. Yep. 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 Uh, does it have nose lift? No. It's my answer, I think. It doesn't have nose lift. Yeah, it does. It's it. Of course it is. It's got nose lift. We've got the, an orange, orange hurricane spider behind as well. Courtesy of Craig. Should we wait for them? I can't be asked. <laughs> what are they doing? There you go. They're coming now. Oh, they are. Oh, come on. Why is it scraping? <laughs> Just to let you know, I am not in control at all. <laughs> Are you going? I'm already distracted. What's, you Where's the windows? Here. All oh, right. <laughs> I wasn't listening. He went through all the controls. I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll work it out. Yeah. I won't because it's. But everyone does that. Everyone yeah. does that. Like they go through the they go through the handover. This does this. This does this. And you're just like, I'll work it out myself. It's He's much like, more of an occasion when you work it out yourself. I will be in here for three hours. <laughs> at the beginning of the video, basically, the. The last video that we did just went so crazy with the views 
that I think a lot of people came to my channel that had never watched one of my videos before and just assumed that we were <laughs> the biggest idiots ever, which we kind of are. Yeah, no, they're, the they're same fair time, on that one. At the same time, this is such a massive day for you. Yeah. You said that you've been working your absolute socks off for the last 10 years in the city, working yep. your way up. Yep, yep, yep. Um, and also London Muscle, which is absolutely flying at the moment. Yeah, it's uh, unfortunately it's definitely not the bank of mum and dad. <laughs> I wish it was, that would have been a lot easier, I would have got a lot more sleep. But, uh, oh, speed camera. It's on the other side, it's fine. Uh, I'm unsure of these things. This is a, this is a big day. Big... Good lord. You're in a lot of trouble. <laughs> I am when you're when you've got one hand on the steering wheel and plugging well, it's busy. <laughs> It's actually surprisingly easy to drive. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's even with it just being rear wheel, you don't feel that there's any. No, slip or I, I think if I give it some beans, then it will. I mean, I'm in, I'm in Strada at the moment, which is comfort, but I'll put it in sport. Ah, there we go. That's a bit more like it. <laughs> <laughs> That's more like it. We're in comfort mode. That's right, old man mode. Is it this downshifting for you? No, that's me, mate. I'm good at this. No, it's uh, it's the car. <laughs> but if you put it in Corsa, which is the hooligan button, uh, do you not do that? <laughs> why not? <laughs> that's ridiculous. Yeah. This is so cool. And you've got a full tank. Lambo Penguin deliver cars with a full tank. There you go. You heard it here first. <laughs> ESC Corsa. Oh, does that mean it's gone off? No, or is it just means it's in course mode? It's just winding. <laughs> really lucky that Fiesta is in front of us. <laughs> oh, I'm lucky for them. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what. The last time we ended the idiots go car shopping was actually in that Bentley that you borrowed. <laughs> <laughs> and now the we're Bentley barge. <laughs> the Bentley barge. Now we're ending it in your brand new Lamborghini Huracan. An idiot has finally bought a car. An idiot has finally bought a car on an Idiot's Go Car Shopping episode. But yeah, what an awesome morning and what a way to kick off the weekend. And now you're heading up to Birmingham, I'm going up to Silverstone. I'm gonna continue this Lamborghini filled weekend and then we are gonna be doing a lot more stuff with this car and potentially going abroad in it. Oh boy. <laughs> we'll, we'll leave it at that, we'll leave it at that. Please give it a thumbs up. I'm gonna leave all of the links in the description for Tom's Instagram and Twitter so you can continue following his journey and also his brand new YouTube channel that he's been filming for today, which I'm a little bit worried as to how that's coming out. Apologies in advance. <laughs> <laughs> so thanks for watching guys. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I look forward to seeing you very soon for probably my Silverstone video that is yet to come. Cheers guys. I thought you were going to scrape it there. That would have been a great way to end the video. <laughs> but I think you put the nose lift up. <laughs>